Trees has got up a little bit. Waddle, let's change the angle. Waddle has to scamper not to be offside. Final ball too long. First five minutes have elapsed. Rowcastle. Nice first touch. Stevens. Webb. Webb. Stevens. Rowcastle diagonally forward. This is he. Waddle. Nice use of the chest again. Lineker. Good tackle by Lekbello. Burns! Good start from England. Again, the move on the right side. And a lovely touch in the middle of it from Chris Waddle. And John Barnes scores for the second England match running. 16 minutes gone, and England have the lead. Stevens with the build up. Brocastle. A look at the touch here by Waddle. Lekbello just got in the challenge, but they'd all been sucked in. Barnes was unmarked. He struck it very cleanly with the right foot. 1-0 to England. Officially 137 supporters here from England. Doesn't, of course, include the media and all the members of the England squad. Here's Shehu! Great credit to Pierce because Butcher was comprehensively beaten and there was just enough as Pierce came here balanced himself to force Shehu to go wide and Shilton was equal to it. He got a touch off both the defender and the goalkeeper but the Nottingham Forest player did enormously well then and an excellent save that finished it. Just a touch and a beautiful tip away by Peter Shilton. The back players like to show themselves in attack which is usually organised by Demolari. This is Shehu. Stevens changed his mind. This is Milo. Another good tip over. The hesitancy in the England defence is clear for all to see. And the gap here for Milo. Web Square, three in the box. Lineker, Rowcastle. It's a good return ball. And Brian Robson it was who came in on the far post and just couldn't make the finish. Ball bobbled away from the stretch of the left leg. Good concern, surely, for Mr. Reddy. And good play again on the right side, that time involving Rowcastle and Lineker. England, of course, in white. Now attacking the goal to our left. Leck Bello, rather dwelt on it. Slight hesitancy, Lineker did well. The goalkeeper able to stretch and get it, which is uh, not. Which goes back, take a position on the far side. Lineker's the first to go. One by Robson, it's 2 nothing. Brian Robson, the England captain, once again, there when it mattered most, got up very well. And he too has scored for England in consecutive matches. 24th goal for his country. And it brings a bit of comfort to this contest and to the attempt by England to qualify for the next World Cup in general. Delay on the free kick, taken in the end by Barnes. And Robson got up so well to head down and Massini was nowhere near it. Be good enough to put them on top of the table. Now Webb back across the front. Acrobatics by Smith, but to no avail. A lot of possession then for England, but uh, never really the threat that it was going to be finished, Trevor. A lot of men forward. Uh, John Barnes cross, good deep cross. Neil Webb heading it back, but as you can see, it's behind the three men that are just around about the six-yard box. Uh, beginning to get to their feet. Shehu, it's all a bit crowded. And the shot is of no importance at all from Yossa. 
as people start to go away. And they walk back to the city center, down the boulevard of the martyrs of the nation. Must be one of the few places in the world these days where you can see a statue of both Lenin and of Stalin. But on the football field here in Albania, England have gained a 2-0 victory. The scorers, Barnes and Robson, it's a score we would have settled for at the start and certainly during the worrying phases of the first half. And it also gives England and their manager, Bobby Robson, time to sort out one or two of the problems. And it also, I believe,